Now that you know where the jobs are, the News Channel 36 job team wants to help you buff up that resume. So tonight, Jennifer Copeland is running down the five mistakes that you're probably making and could be keeping you from getting that job. Believe it or not, mistake number one is spelling errors. Yes, in the age of spell check, it is still the most common mistake. Mistake number two, it doesn't stand out. You're writing the same thing everyone else is writing. So write what they can't. Be specific about your accomplishments. Companies really like to see folks that say, we accomplished you know, our projects on time, uh, within budget, or ahead of schedule. Uh, we solved this problem. Mistake number three, using buzzwords. Words like skillfully, effectively, carefully, quickly, expert mastered, um, those again are, are generic buzzwords that don't mean anything. So give those words meaning. Brag about yourself, but back it up with examples. If you work in an area that you save the company a lot of money, put it down and put down the amount of money that you save the company. Which brings us to mistake number four. You're not using numbers. How large of a budget did you manage? Or how much cost savings did you provide through the project that you worked on? Uh, those numbers are really important. And finally, mistake number five. You're cramming too much in. See this? The resume on the left, long and wordy. But the one to the right is how it should look. Simple and easy to read. Here's something else to keep in mind. Most managers will only give your resume a 10-second scan, maybe 30, so it has to be good. Head over to WCNC.com and click on the job team. There you can find all kinds of helpful information to help you do your resume. Jennifer Copeland, News Channel 36.